Nothing, it's a card from my dad. What is it? I... Dear son, happy Festivus? What is Festivus? It's nothing, it's nothing. When George was growing Jeremy, up, no. his father no. hated all the commercial and religious aspects of Christmas, yeah. so he made up his own holiday. Oh, and another piece of the puzzle falls into place. All right. And instead of a tree, didn't your father put up an aluminum pole? Oh, Jerry, no. stop it. And then weren't there feats of strength that always ended up with you crying? I can't huh? take it anymore. I'm going to work. You happy now? <laughs> I got your message. I haven't celebrated Festivus in years. What is your interest? Well, just tell me everything, huh? Many Christmases ago, I went to buy a doll for my son. I reached for the last one they had, but so did another man. As I rained blows upon him, I realized there had to be another way. What happened to the doll? It was destroyed. But out of that, a new holiday was born. A Festivus for the rest of us. Well, that must have been some kind of doll. She was. <laughs> and at the Festivus dinner, you gather your family around and tell them all the ways they have disappointed you over the past year. And is there a tree? No, instead there's a pole. Requires no decoration. I find tinsel distracting. Frank, this new holiday of yours is scratching me right where I itch. Let's do it then. All right. Festivus is back! I'll get the pole out of the crawl space. Hello, Frank. Hello, woman. Well, happy Festivus. What is that? Is that the pole? George, Festivus is your heritage. It's part of who you are. That's why I hate it. Look, it's a big dinner Tuesday night at Frank's house. Everyone's invited. George, you're forgetting how much Festivus has meant to us all. I brought one of the cassette tapes. Read that poem. I can't read it. I need my glasses. You don't need glasses. You're just weak. You're weak. Leave him alone! <laughs> all right, George. It's time for the Festivus Feats of Strength. Oh, no! Turn it off! No Feats of Strength! I come on, Festivus! We had some good times. They nailed you on the 20 Gs? Busted gold. <laughs> it's made from aluminum. Very high strength to weight ratio. I find your belief system fascinating. <laughs> hey! Happy Festivus, everyone! <laughs> Welcome, newcomers. The tradition of Festivus begins with the airing of grievances. I got a lot of problems with you people. Now, you're gonna hear about it. You, Kruger, my son tells me your company stinks. Oh, God. Why? you will get yours in a minute. Kruger, you couldn't smooth a silk sheet if you had a hot date with a babe. I lost my train of thought. Jerry. Gwen, how did you know I was here? Kramer told me. Another Festivus miracle. <laughs> I guess this is the ugly girl I've been hearing about. Hey, I was in a schwitz for six hours. Give me a break. <laughs> Gwen, Gwen, wait! Ah! Bad lighting on the porch. Hey, how did my horse do? He had to be shot. And now, as Festivus rolls on, we come to the feats of strength. Not the feats of strength. <laughs> this year, the honor goes to Mr. Kramer. Uh-oh. Oh, gee, Frank, I'm sorry. I gotta go. I have to work a double shift at H&H. &H. I thought you were on strike. Yeah, well, I caved. I mean, I really had to use their bathroom. <laughs> Frank, no offense, but this holiday's a little... <laughs> out there. Hey, Kramer, you, you can't go. Who's gonna do the feats of strength? How about George? <laughs> Good thinking, Cougar. Until you pin me, George, Festivus is not over. Oh, please, somebody stop this. Let's rumble! I think you can take him, Georgie. Right, come on, be sensible. Stop crying and fight your father. Ow! Oh, I guess! This is I the guess. best Festivus oh, ever! Oh, no!